everybody. Well, it is not spring yet, but I decided to come to King's Park because I thought the wildflowers might have started coming out and I've got nothing to put on the YouTube next week, which is this week when you hear this, and let you know that I'm still here. It's just we've had shocking rain for the last uh, two or three weeks. Haven't been able to go many places. So have a good week or two weeks. Hopefully I'll have something for the following week. Did I say that um, it's a beautiful day here? We had 25 degrees the week last week, which you'll see in the York video, which was the last video. And I don't know what the temperature is today, but Perth looks absolutely stunning from Kings Park. So you'll see photos of that before you see the wildflowers. I'm just going to see the last of the wildflowers that are around and then I shall go home. See yous! Show you a map of the King's Park. Doesn't look very good there, but it is. It's quite big. I'm walking around a certain part of it at the moment. I love seeing so many everlastings in clumps, so pretty. I actually was driving in and I saw these and I thought I'll have to walk over and get a photo. So pretty. Pinks and whites and crimson. Lots of bees around, pollinating. I'll have to turn the volume up on this when I edit it because I haven't got my headphones on or speak uh, microphone on. In less than two weeks it'll be spring. Thank goodness. Sick of the rain.
Today when I went out, I went out with the thoughts that I wouldn't be able to get any footage for next week and it's turned into such a beautiful day in Perth that I've gone to a couple of places and this is stunning here, so calm, just the birds, no one around. So I did have something for next week after all. Perth is so pretty today. Hi everybody, just want to say thank you to those that have subscribed, um, thanks to those that watch my videos and thanks to those that like it. So hope that um, the people that are seeing this will subscribe to my channel and I'm trying to build it up a little bit. So we do run out of things to show around Perth but Perth is a changing city, it doesn't matter what time of the day, there's something different to look at. The, um, the light, the sky, the, the sun, the moon, the clouds, everything's different every day. And we've just had a couple of weeks of rain. So I'm in a nice little spot at the moment where you can just hear the birds in the background. It's a bit crooked so anyway hope you'll um subscribe like i said thank you be nice to have some more subscribers and more viewers thanks bye
Don't get too close to them. It'll scare them. They'll chase you if you get too close. They say they're going to be chopping down hundreds of trees in the Perth region because of some virus. This is the first one I've seen gone.